Patricia, thank you very much. Well, stores are making an extra effort to get your money this <laughs> holiday. They get my money, that's for <laughs> sure. Many are stepping up sales before Black Friday. They're also offering deals if you open up one of those store credit cards. Call 6 Watchdog Rafael Sanchez is live in the newsroom with what you need to know before saying yes, Rafael. So yes, assuming you have good credit, opening a store credit card to get that extra discount is a good idea. The big pitfall is, of course, those store cards often have super high interest, so you don't want to end up uh, with those long-running bills. So pay it on time, cut it up, get rid of it, use up the advantage of the card, but don't keep it. Can you do that for me? I'm going to try. Raphael, you know, sometimes for those hard-to-buy-for people, it's simple just to get a gift card for friends and family, but I'm always afraid of those unwanted fees. I wonder if that's going to be associated with it. Well, this year, a new federal law passed in August should pay off this holiday. Money on a gift card cannot expire for at least five years from the date of purchase. Now, any fees that are attached to the card must be fully disclosed on the back, so buyer beware. Read everything on the card behind you before you buy it before those fees start just eating up at the card. All right, an app for that. And you had an app for gift cards, huh? And I'm old school, but you can <laughs> send people a gift card, and when they go shopping, the cashier, and off you, minichannel.com. But as I mentioned, I'm going to leave the app stuff to you youngings. I'm not going to be able to swipe, I'm going to go domo, and then move yes. on. I can't handle all that app stuff. I I'm just keep it simple. Keep it Thank simple. you so much. Rafael Santos live in the news.